road right now. It's Holy Thursday. We are on our way up from Miami to go to St. Augustine for the weekend to celebrate Easter and our first wedding anniversary. So happy, so excited. We left our apartment and AJ was like, this is the last time we're gonna be in our apartment during our first year of marriage, which is crazy. Next time we get back there, we're gonna be in our second year of marriage, so. Super fun, we're really excited, so we'll take you guys along for the ride of our Holy Week adventure in St. Augustine. into our Airbnb in St. Augustine. It's really, really cute. And today we basically just drove here. We had a little road trip. We listened to podcasts and music and prayed a rosary and offered up a lot of your intentions that you told us um, that you would like prayers for on Instagram. So we prayed for all of those. And then we went straight to the Holy Thursday Mass at the Cathedral Basilica and um, went to Mass there. We were a few minutes late, but it's okay. And it was beautiful. And the Bishop of St. Augustine was there celebrating Mass. And then we went to Adoration for a little bit, which was so nice. I said I couldn't even remember the last time that I went to Adoration. And I really needed to go more because it was really good. And I really needed it. it was, uh... Good day. It took a little longer getting here than we thought. Um, we also left an hour later than we planned on leaving. Yeah, so we went straight to Mass, but it was a very good day. Beautiful Mass. Very excited for uh, the Triduum and now we're in it and, and all the gifts that come with that. We went to food. We went to go eat at Harry's. We went to food. We went to food. <laughs> I guess I'm tired. We walked around first. We walked around um, St. George Street, which we'll walk around more tomorrow when it's daylight, but it was really cute. And it was late, so a lot of the restaurants were closing. So we finally went to Harry's, Harry's. which AJ found. Harry's. He's, he's like really good. I don't think I've said this on here before, but he's really good at finding good restaurants. And it was really cute. We had tuna and crab cakes and fried green yeah. tomatoes. Fried green tomatoes are so good. Not to be confused with Porta. Porta. Just Harry's. But I think you said that like way delayed. <laughs> you said Harry's like 10 minutes ago. You guys, it's okay. What is that? It's, what, it's okay. What's happening here? It's okay. <laughs> no. We're gonna go to sleep and then tomorrow is a new day with new adventures and we're excited to explore St. Augustine. Can't wait. Good night. Good night everyone. We rode our bikes to this cute little juice shop and we're having smoothies and then we're gonna go for a little walk. Friday and we're having a beautiful relaxing 
meditative morning. We came to this, what's it called? Anastasia Park. Anastasia State, State Park. Park. And it's really beautiful. And we're on the water, we're sitting, and we just finished praying the Office of Readings. And we went for a bike ride and a hike, and it's really beautiful. Yeah, it's been a nice, peaceful day. Mm -hmm. Yeah, really relaxing and I'm excited because usually we have really busy trips and we plan a lot of stuff and we were really intentional about having a relaxing trip so we've been relaxing very well this morning. So we're gonna go get ready for mass now. I'll have a little snack uh, since we're fasting today over a small meal and then we're going to the service for a good Friday. So we will continue our adventures. Yay! shoulder. Shoot. This is the Leitner Museum. How do you say it? We're in the the mission de Dios, de nombre. How do you say it? Nombre, nombre, de Dios. nombre de Dios mission. What does that mean? Uh, the mission of the name of Jesus, right? Yep. And it's so beautiful. This is literally like one of my favorite places ever. Um, and there's a shrine to Our Lady of La Leche, and we're about to go in and pray. And there's all these little. Um, spots to pray along the way that have the seven sorrows of Mary. We were just talking about how Mary was the perfect mother but her motherhood was super imperfect and super tragic and difficult. We're just here praying and it's beautiful and it's my favorite. This is the rustic altar where we're gonna have Easter Mass tomorrow morning. This is where they celebrated the first Catholic Mass in the new colony. In, in the, the United US. Yeah, right? In the United States. How? Freaking cool is that? Happy anniversary! Happy Easter! Okay, well, we're at home now, <laughs> um, but we just wanted to come on and finish updating on our trip because it was such a great trip and we really didn't explain much of what we did, but we did so many fun things, so I'm going to try to remember what we need to update about. We had an amazing weekend. Today is Easter Sunday. Happy Easter, everyone. Happy Easter, and it's also our first wedding anniversary yep yay what a gift so we've had a really beautiful wedding anniversary and a happy easter today we um checked out of our airbnb which we stayed in a really cute airbnb i think i said that and we went to mass at the mission bless are those called to the supper of the lamb lord i am not worthy that you should enter under my roof but only say the word and my soul shall be healed 
After Mass, we stayed and asked a priest to guide us through renewing our vows for our first anniversary. And that was AJ's idea and that was really special and beautiful. So we did a vow renewal, um, which we have done probably five times this year already. <laughs> um, but it's just awesome to renew the vows and remember the vows that we took a year ago. And so that was really nice. And then, oh, AJ took me to this really good vegan place for breakfast this morning and it was really good we had amazing food this whole trip very good um yeah like really good seafood and vegan food and smoothies and all kinds of stuff that was really good and then we just drove home and on our way home aj had an idea of surprising my family on our way home because it was on our drive back down so we popped in and said hi to my parents and my grandparents and that was really nice and special and, and they were actually very surprised. Yeah, they were really surprised. And then we got back here and we had our wedding cake in the freezer from last year. And so AJ's parents and sister came over and we had our wedding cake and a bottle of wine that was meant for our first anniversary from my sister-in-law. And so we had that and celebrated, which was so fun. So it's been such a good Easter. We're so grateful to our lord for the gift of each other and for the gift of resurrection it's been amazing just to have it on the same day for our first anniversary i think it's just so meaningful to us and god is so good so we give him all the glory of our marriage friday i have put some i have some clips that i'll share from the living stations of the cross and this group that did this um, performance of the living stations of the cross they are i don't remember what they're called but they are a group of men and women from a drug and alcohol rehabilitation program that's three years and they were incredible like the acting in this performance of the living stations was incredible i've never seen the living stations before but i don't think it's normally like that you've seen it before right yeah it's not normally like that it was amazing it was so realistic and so well acted and put together and narrated and that was super super nice called the Leitner Museum we walked around and then I went to confession at the Cathedral Basilica Basilica Cathedral Cathedral Basilica Cathe Cathedral Basilica Ooh, excuse me I'm <laughs> a little sleepy right now and then we went to the Easter Vigil and but before the Easter Vigil we had our special anniversary dinner oh yeah we went to this place called what was it called preserved it was amazing the food was great the service was great. It was a really cute house that turned into a restaurant. Do you want to switch to a Chardonnay? And yeah, we had our anniversary dinner there. Then we went to the Easter Vigil, which was so nice, so special, amazing. And then we went to get ice cream and pretzels. Yes. You can guess who wanted the ice cream and who wanted the pretzels. I'm obsessed with soft pretzels, like if that's ever a choice. And mustard, there needs to be mustard. So I had sweet mustard and pretzels, and he had cookie dough ice cream with hot fudge and sprinkles. That's like... Rainbow colored. If anything could describe our personalities, that describes our personalities. You getting ice cream and me getting soft pretzels. All in all, it was a wonderful long weekend for Easter and our anniversary. Very moving spiritually and 
a lot of good time reflecting on our marriage, things to do better, on things that we did well, and uh, and looking forward to year number two. Yeah, we came up with a whole list on the car ride home of like awesome things that happened during our first year, and it was a good year. We had such a good year. Very good. Anyway, that's all. Hope you guys enjoyed following along with our weekend, and we will see you guys soon. Bye!